Okay. <clears throat> we about to end this debate right now. But we about to figure this out. About what's going on with the presidency. Um, who will be the next president? Will it be Kamala Harris, Donald Trump? And everybody, you know, we already know what Trump bring it to the table. But everybody keeps saying Kamala Harris is black. I think she got some, for me to be honest, she might be black, but the biggest question is how? Like, how did that happen? So, what we about to do is, which everybody could have done by now, is um, we about to look into it and see if and how Kamala Harris became black. <laughs> black Black Is that black? That's black Are you that color? But okay First thing we go do Cause we already know her mother is Indian Or from India So we ain't gotta do nothing Look into her moms To see if she black Or if it come from that side So we gonna go straight to her pops which is Donald J. Harris. Boom. Who is Kamala's father? Oh, it popped right up. All right, that's him right there. All right. So, Donald Harris. So, we about to go to this Wikipedia and see what's going on with it. So, we just go, we go slide over. Donald Harris was raised in Jamaica, St. Anne Parish. That's what's up. That's what's up. August 23rd, 1938. Damn. It's the, tomorrow's birthday? Tomorrow's birthday. That's funny. Okay. I ain't even for the take all day. But that's where we gonna go at. Okay, boom. Right here. Born in, y'all see where he was born in, Brownstown. Okay, that's what's up. St. Anne Parish, Jamaica, the son of Oscar, Burrow, whatever her name was, who were African Jamaicans, Afro Jamaicans, whatever that is. So, okay, that's what's up. I told you make it a child. Alright, what? And baptized, all that. Boom, 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 boom. Let's see, let's, let's get into this. This um, paternal grandmother. So that's the mother of his father. Hmm. Okay. His paternal grandmother. Born Christina Brown told Harris. What y'all think she told him? What y'all think she told Harris? That he was gonna marry Kamala in the future. Let's see. So it say Harris's paternal grandmother, born Christina Brown, told Harris that. She was descended from Irish born plantation owner Hamilton Brown. Wowzers. 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 Okay. Uh, yeah. 1776, 1843. Founded this church. I don't know if that's supposed to say Angelican or, you know what I'm saying, whatever, but. Who buried there? Oh, she buried there. Hamilton Brown owned that lease. Oh, shit. He got it in. Boom. Slaves. Most of them. On sugar plantation. 
in St. Anne Parish and was instrumental in the importance of several hundred laborers and their families from Ireland to Jamaica between mm -hmm. 1835 and 1840, baby. Okay, so Hamilton Brown. This tripod is just like so janky, Hamilton Brown. Let's 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 see who do it is. Let's check out let's check out Mr. Brown. Hamilton Brown. Y'all already see that. Irish born planner and politician. I guess, okay, who was out in St. Anthony, Jamaica, which he represented in the House of Assembly of Jamaica for 22 years. He founded the settlement of, Ham of Hamilton Town in St. Anthony Parish, which was named after him. Ooh, that boy got in. He gave his name to Brownstown. Ooh. Originally known as Hamilton Town. Oh, okay. He just switched it up. Okay. Yeah. What he paid for the construction of the original St. Mark's Ooh. Church in Brownstown. Got it in. What? Is that supposed to say Angelican or whatever? Because whatever that word is. I can't say it. Andrew Clean? Andrew Clean? Man, get it. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm not saying that. Okay, but boom. According to the legacies of British slave ownership at the University College of London, Brown was awarded a, a what? A payment under the Slave Compensation Act 1837 as a former slave only in the aftermath of the Slavery Abolition Act 1833. The British government took out a $15 million loan worth $1.8 billion in 2024. That boy got paid with interest. Nathan Mayor Rothschild. Oh boy, these boys get it in. And Moses Montefiore. Or whatever. Which was subsequently paid off by the British taxpayers. What? That's how y'all doing it, people? What? In, what? Hold on. By the British taxpayers. In the damn in 2015? Damn. Brown was probably a prolific slave only in the context of Jamaican society and was associated with a large number of claims, 25 in total. He owned 1,120 slaves, sugar plantations, most of them in St. Anne, Parish, and received a 24,144 equivalent to 2.8. Nine million twenty twenty four payment at the time. Well, I ain't gonna say much. I mean, you know, I mean, what else y'all want to hear? Just leave that right there, or you know what I'm saying? Wherever you want to put it on the real. So, is Kamala Harris black? Maybe. How? <laughs> That's the question. Because there's a bunch of weird stuff going on around here, baby. But hey, though, y'all can take this information. Y'all can do what y'all want with it. Figure it out for yourself. Uh, it's all there. Hamilton Brown. Hey, he part of her bloodline. It ain't too far away. He lived, he died in 18, 1830, 1843. And her father grandmother was a descendant of him i don't know if she i don't know if he was her father uncle i don't know how they put it but hey it was blood and if her father was born in 1938 then you know it ain't it ain't too far behind it might seem like it but you know do the math on the real 
But y'all decide, hey, please leave a comment. And if Trump find this out, man, and he asks her about this, I think she might just have to run off stage on the real, though, because it's just like what you go say on the real. What you go say is right here. It's like it's on the internet. It's just like normal information. But like I said, like she might have some black in it, but it's kind of suspicious of how that came about. <laughs> Look like somebody was doing some mingling and uh, fraternizing. <laughs> but y'all let me know. I'm out of here, man. I'll look back.